What's up, my little Tabatals? How y'all doing today? Well, baby, if you are Chloe the Doormat Kardashian, <laughs> whoo, listen, I got two questions. Um, does anybody have contract? Do I have contractors in California? Uh, write me this. How does it take to fix a leaky roof? Um, and also, why is Kim selfishly hogging up all of Tristan's time? Third of all, Chloe was mad, 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 mad. She even started posting pictures looking like Kim borrowing her dehydrated Momo wig. And it seems like all Tristan had to do was make some dry, soupy looking curry, y'all. Let's get into this. All right. If you guys don't know, Chloe released an article yesterday, or at least her people did, saying that Tristan, uh, she, you know, she feels anxious about dating. She doesn't know what to do. She doesn't know how to allow new men in her life. What man is dating you with an infant in your arms and the baby's father sleeping in the same bed with you? Stop this madness. But one of the reasons people said that article was released is because Chloe is trying to get Tristan's attention back from Kim. Now, let me just say this, right? Kim just literally played herself bad at the Drake concert. But once again, she had her partner in crime, Tristan. Now, I've said it once and I've said it again, but I just don't understand how people really don't get it, okay? What Kim is doing with Tristan is selfish. Let's just say that Tristan isn't the diggity diggity dog of our century, isn't one of the disciples of a, a demon born and whatever. Let's just say that Tristan was not trying to dig down everybody in the Kardashian family with his Vegas, Vegas, Canadian Valley girl. Like, I remember, but like, Tristan's like, yo, that booty looking right. I feel like he talks like Bella Hadid, right? <laughs> Homegirl can <laughs> get it, right? But all, with all jokes aside, let's just say Tristan wasn't somebody of low moral character, someone of low moral hygiene, someone that literally is only going to have bad karma because he only puts bad vibes out in the universe. I don't care what y'all say. Anybody that is a deadbeat dad, again, and I'm not just talking about financial, I'm talking about emotional, especially after they just lost their parent and knows how much a parent means in life and you still choose to withhold your time, your affection and your energy of a baby boy that looked just like you. Baby, you got low moral hygiene, baby. You are less than a person. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I don't make the rules. God does. Anyway, y'all, so I'm not saying that Tristan, let's just say that all that stuff wasn't true. And Tristan was a good person. And let's just say, I don't think Kim would ever mess with Tristan. But then again, she's been acting so thirsty, goofy, desperate. I don't know. Like at this point, I'm just like, Kanye is a magician. He made us forget that he married a thirst bucket groupie. And now she's back to her original ways, okay? Now, and the thing, okay, but that's a different, I did a video about it, go watch it. I won't go too much into it. But let's just assume that Tristan wasn't that, and Kim. Does Kim not find her actions extremely selfish? Y'all might be like, oh my God, I hang out with my sister's boyfriend all the time. My sister's like, okay, fine. I'm not saying anything's gonna happen, but let's just know this. Chloe has three kids all under the age five. She got True, she got Tatum, and on Rob's visitation time, she got Dream. She also is helping care for Tristan's brother. Tristan is getting all the benefits of the wife without any of the commitment. And that's cool because that's just what Chloe likes. That's what Chloe's into. Like I said, Chloe's into doormat time. If she actually got a man that treated her right, I feel like she would run away screaming because she doesn't know how to do that. Unless she is completely sacrificing and building someone up, she is afraid that she is so worthless that if she's not, all my opinion people, that if she's not pouring into someone, she has no value. But let's just assume that Tristan ain't a dog. Kim's not selfish. If you knew that your sister had three kids on the age five and another child that was special needs, and she is raising all of them, true with the nannies, but you're still raising all of them. Chloe actually seems like a pretty hands-on mom. I'm just saying. Do you think that you would be so selfish to keep inviting or letting the 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 father of those children be out with you 
honestly. And this is where Chloe's anger is coming from. That's why she posted this picture where she's dressed like Kim in the dehydrated Momo wig because Chloe's passive aggressive and she's also down. She already burned that bridge with Courtney. So now what is she supposed to do? With Kim, she can't say anything because you know the way Kim is. She will cut you off in a second. And what's Chloe going to do if she's not licking Kim's boots? But honestly, is it not a bit of selfishness? I get it. Kim has social anxiety. She doesn't like showing up places alone. She thinks her, you know how she always likes image, right? Her hairdresser, Chris, is married. So they're in their honeymoon stage. She thinks that Tristan is a good look. She thinks that he's a good influence on Saint. She thinks the guy that she just yes, last year was calling Lord Voldemort, she now thinks that he's like, what? A good guy. Even if all that's true. Kim, if you want someone to be a father to the kids, go call Kanye and tell him to put that ice cream down and come get the kids. Or you got a private just go drop the kids off to him. Right? Because you can do that. But you won't. Instead, you got Tristan playing daddy to the to Saint. Okay, whatever. But even then, how is it that you are letting going clubbing with Tristan in Miami, clubbing with Tristan at the uh, Lakers game, clubbing with Tristan at the after party? So he comes crawling home, and you know Chloe has an attitude. So he's making some dry curry chicken, look like curry chicken soup in the house because probably that's Chloe's favorite. Hey, Tristan is such a mess. You've been gone for 16 hours and 15 days, right? And you literally come back in to cook dinner, act like you father of the year, probably cooking curry chicken because you got a hangover. You cooking it for yourself. But honestly, how selfish is it that your sister will pull your man out the house and Tristan's willing to go? to be your plus one because you don't want to show up places alone and you don't want to feel awkward you don't want to do this you don't do that what about the three kids under five that's at the house two of them yours one you play an uncle to and the other one is your brother y'all and speaking of which this curry chicken Tristan just let, let everybody know by that curry chicken that she he is still living with Chloe. If you notice from the video of him showing his curry chicken recipe, which I probably, that's what he makes for Chloe every time he mad, she's mad at him, which is probably a lot. She's probably eating curry chicken Monday, Wednesday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Anyway, right? If you look at the marble, it's the exact same marble in Chloe's kitchen. Also, Chloe did a big job of bragging that her kitchen are custom cabinets with custom colors. And here we see from Tristan's video that they are the exact same cabinets, the exact same colors, and the exact same color of the marble. So let me say this. She said that Tristan moved in because his roof caved in. That was, when did they stop filming Keeping Up with the Kardashian? Months ago? Tristan's still laying up with her in the bed. The only difference is instead of him leaving to just go club by himself, now your sister's texting him like, Tristan, what's up? Let's go. Y'all listen, you can say what you want about Chloe. And I say a lot. She is a dum-dum. She really doesn't deserve the way Tristan and now Kim is doing her. Again, Tristan hasn't been picked up by a new team. He always comes trying to make nice with Chloe and the Kardashians when he thinks he might need them because Tristan is a straight up user. He literally has a wife situation, somebody that is raising, being a matriarch, helping him with his brother, raising his kids, keeping his house down. And he's out partying with her sister every night. And Kim is actually teaching Chloe that this is cool. It's cruel in my mind. It's cruel. I mean, honestly, were you partying? In Miami, don't forget you gotta take flights down there. So he's taking the private plane with her to the Drake concert in Miami, in this, in that, while you know that he got basically a newborn baby and the mother said that she's having trouble bonding with the baby because the baby looked just like her. Y'all listen, let me know what you think in the comments. I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.